Welcome to another grammar lesson brought to you by ebanka.com and Genki Kids e Kaiwa. In this lesson, we will cover location and prepositions. Where? All right, let's get started. With where questions, you put the where plus be verb at the front of the sentence and the subject followed by a question mark at the end. As in, where is the book? Where are the books? When you mention the subject in the question, you can use either the same subject in the answer or you can use it or they instead, so you aren't being redundant. As in, it is on the desk, or the book is on the desk, they are on the desk, the books are on the desk. Okay, so in the first example, where is the book? It is on the desk. It equals the book. So instead of saying the book two times, you could just use it, which is very convenient. And in the second example, where are the books? They are on the desk. They equals the books. So instead of saying the books, Two times, you can just use the word they. So it is used for the singular time and they for the plural case. Okay, let's try those examples one more time. Where is the book? It is on the desk. The book is on the desk. Where are the books? They are on the desk. The books are on the desk. Where is the book? It is on the desk. The book is on the desk. Where are the books? They are on the desk. The books are on the desk. Okay, let's practice with some more examples. Here we go. Where is the cat? It is under the table. Where are the birds? They are above. The tree. Where is Colin? He is next to the school. Where is your mother? She is in the kitchen. Where are my socks? They are. On the chair. Okay, let's try that at a normal speed. Where is the cat? It is under the table. Where are the birds? They are above the tree. Where is Colin? He is next to the school. Where is your mother? She is in the kitchen. Where are my socks? They are on the chair. Okay, you read the sentences next. Where is the cat? It is under the table. Where are the birds? They are above the tree. Where is Colin? He is next to the school. Where is your mother? She is in the kitchen. Where are my socks? They are on the chair. Great. Excellent, everybody. Thank you for listening. For more practice using lessons and tests, check out ebankyo.com. ebankyo is a website that provides over 14,000 different lessons and tests that enable students to learn and practice English at their own pace. There are many lessons available for all levels, starting from basic vocab, phonics, and grammar. Each of the points covered. We'll also have many corresponding lessons and tests at ebankyo.com. I hope to see you there. Have a good day.